Hi, I'm Brandon Grant, Marketing Director here at Quoteworks. Today we're going to demonstrate how to use the QuickBooks desktop integration to easily and seamlessly export your documents from Quoteworks to QuickBooks. The integration includes the ability to export any document from Quoteworks to QuickBooks as an estimate, sales order, or invoice. If an item on a document does not exist in QuickBooks, Quoteworks will create it for you. If a customer does not exist, Quoteworks will create that customer for you also. The integration currently supports QuickBooks Pro, Premier, and Enterprise. So let's get started. To access the integration with QuickBooks, click on your Tools, Export to QuickBooks menu, or you can click on the QuickBooks icon in the toolbar. Both options will open up the Export to QuickBooks window, and you'll see that you have two tabs available, the Non-Exported Documents tab and the Payments tab. The non-exported tabs will have a list of documents that are ready for exporting based on your filter set when you had set up the QuickBooks integration. The Payments tab will include any payment that has come from a document that was accepted and paid through Quote Valley. These payments can also be exported to QuickBooks. To select a document or multiple documents to export, simply click on the checkbox next to the document number. You can select a single or multiple documents to export. For this example, we're just going to start with a single document. Once you've selected your document, simply click on the Export button. It is important to note to use this integration, you do need to have QuoteWorks open as well as QuickBooks running at the same time. So let's click Export, and this will open up our Select QuickBooks Sales Tax Item. We want to set the tax for this particular document. So we can change it if we need to, or it'll use the default setting that you have set, and click OK. The next thing that will happen is QuoteWorks will prompt you to create this QuickBooks item if this item number or the manufacturer number does not exist currently in QuickBooks. You can also see the item's description, so if you want to adjust it, shorten it, lengthen it, whatever changes you want to make to it, you can do that. From here, we can then set the item type, whether it's a service, inventory part, or non-inventory part, and select the account. If you've selected a default account, that one will be pre-selected for you, but you can click on the drop-down menu to select the proper account or to change the account if needed. If this is an inventory item, you'll be able to select your preferred vendor as well as the expense account as needed. Since this item is not, I'm going to leave that unchecked and then hit OK. You'll be prompted to repeat this step for any items that exist on that document that do not currently exist in QuickBooks. It will remember your previous settings, so if all the items are similar or assigned to the same account, we can simply click OK to click through. Once finished, the QuickBooks export confirmation window will appear, and it will let you know that this order number has now been created in QuickBooks as invoice number 1100 in this case. In our example, we're using the QuickBooks numbering sequence. If we were using the QuoteWorks numbering sequence, it would show us the QuoteWorks number here instead. So we'll go ahead and click OK and close out of this window. And let's go back into QuickBooks. So if we go into QuickBooks and we go into our invoices, we'll click Find. And we know the number, so we'll type in 1100 and click Find. That'll open up that invoice in QuickBooks. You'll see here we have a list of the items that were sent over to QuickBooks. So it looks just like we had created the document manually in QuickBooks, but in a fraction of the time. You can repeat these steps as often as needed until you've exported all your documents from QuoteWorks to QuickBooks. On the export screen, if you're going to be batch exporting documents, you simply need to select the documents and click Export. QuoteWorks will run through each document and each line item, creating them in QuickBooks as those separate documents. Once finished, you'll be brought to this export screen and hopefully have no more documents ready for exporting. For more information on using the QuickBooks integration, please visit our help file or simply contact us directly. Thanks for watching.